So today I'm going to discuss the Visiflex 2. Is it worth it? Should you invest in this for your M11 series bodies? For me, it's imperative to have as a backup. This is a rangefinder. They can go out of alignment. If that happened at a job with me, I would be in trouble. Having the Visiflex is going to allow me to focus. Yes, I'm going to have to switch to LEDs because I cannot use strobe when I'm using the Visiflex, but I have LED backups with me at all times for every single job, just for that reason. So that's the most important thing for me. Do I use this a lot? I pray to God I never have to use it as a job at a job, but if I do, it, it's going to be a godsend. The second reason to have it is for those 1.2 and 1.0 lenses. Now, I'm very good at focusing with a rangefinder. Even at 1.4, I'm pretty damn decent. But if I'm shooting at 1.2 or 1.0, nobody is that good. Um, I'm going to get a lot more keepers in focus shots if I'm using the Visiflex versus using the rangefinder. So that's a big help. I don't shoot wide ang or wide open like that very often, but when I do, this is going to come in handy. The other part, the other time I'm using this is when I'm shooting live events or 90 millimeter lens. Um, I, I need the Visiflex to help me focus, to nail focus for that. Uh, and again, it's not very often, but when I need it, it's there. And I like that you have the tilt feature, um, you know, so I can shoot down. You know, it's like having that tilty screen that everybody loves on a Leica M. <laughs> That's a pretty impressive. Um, but I do like this. Is it the best in the world? No, but it's very good. Uh, it does the job and it does it well. So my answer to everyone that's asking, you know, should they invest in this Visiflex 2? I, you know, if it's going to pay for itself, if you use wide open lenses like a 1.2, 1.0, 0.95, it's going to come in extremely handy. Or if you're using, you know, telephoto lenses, it's going to help quite a bit, get a lot more keepers um, because of those situations. If you're shooting at F2, 2.8, or you, you shoot zone focusing with your M, it's not going to do you much good. But if you need it, obviously it's worth the investment. Uh, so for me, that's the two reasons I, I, I have the Visiflex and, and it's really, really important investment for me. Um, anyway, I'm shooting on the Nikon ZF with a 50 millimeter 1.8 lens. I really wanted to try video on this. I wanted to see if I could do an actually, hopefully higher quality video for once and, and see how it is. And it, it looks good, uh, from here, <laughs> I'm looking at a little tiny screen, but it looks okay. And I'm using a new led that I'm going to tell you about on the 16th. I'm really impressed with these, um, you know, they won't replace my GVMs in the studio, but on location, these may be the ones coming with me uh, because of the form factor of these, which is really, really impressive. Anyway, thanks for watching as always. If you have any questions, leave them below. Um, thanks.